Hello, hope everybody is doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add Apple Pay to Shopify store. The first thing you want to do once you are on your admin page on Shopify, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on settings. After selecting settings, you are going to tap on payments. Once you have selected payments, you will be redirected to this page. And depending on the country you are in, you are going to see your payment page set up like this. And what I want you to do next is tap on See All Providers. After tapping on See All Providers, you'll be redirected to this dashboard. And you're going to tap on Payment Methods. Then you're going to select Apple Pay. After selecting Apple Pay, you'll see these payment providers that will provide your users with the option to select Apple Pay. So let's say, for example, we want to use Air Wallex. You can also use Braintree or you can use any one of these payment methods. But for this example, I will select this option. After selecting the option, you'll be redirected to this dashboard. And from here, you're going to tap on Connect. After you have tapped on connect, you will be redirected to a new page on which you will be able to install this payment method. So you are going to be redirected to this page right here. And all you will need to do now is tap on install app. Before tapping on install app, let me show you some more information about Airwallex. So you can see I'm on airwallex.com and you can read more about them as they offer global payment methods. And by scrolling down, you'll be able to see that they do offer Apple Pay as one of their payment methods. As you can see right here, featured methods, they accept American Express, MasterCard, Apple Pay, Google Pay, PayPal, and numerous other payment methods, Alipay, WeChat, and you can see right there. So all we'll need to do is go back, then you'll tap on Install App. After selecting install app, you will be redirected to this page right here. And after you are redirected to this page, you will be able to continue setting it up. So the first thing you are going to do, you are going to log in, then you can continue setting up this payment method. And once you have set up the payment method, you will see the Apple Pay option. So let me do that real quick. You cannot use this payment method because you haven't finished setting up your account with them. So let me see right here. So we are going to tap on manage. Let me tap on manage real quick. After you have tapped on manage, you're going to tap on create your free account. So you'll tap right here and you're going to create an account. Once you have created the account, you will be able to integrate it on Shopify. So let me do that real quick. I'm going to tap right there. Once on this page, what I want you to do, as you can see right here, accept payments on your own website. You're going to tap right there. Then after you have done that, you're going to scroll down. You can see right there, how do you plan to use Air, Air Wallex account? And you can see right there, collect payments from my store on marketplaces. You can also tap on that if you want and to get paid by sending payments to links to my customers you can select that if you would want also receive bank transfers directly from customers around the world you could tap on that and then from there you are going to scroll down and we are going to tap on i agree 
then you are going to tap on create account then give it a few seconds and you're going to see your account has been successfully created then you'll see is your business venture backed and you can answer this basic survey so you can tap on yes or no and then you can see how many employees do you have you can select that then you'll tap on take me to dashboard once you have tapped on take me to dashboard you will be redirected to the dashboard and i'm going to show you what to do from there once on the dashboard the first thing you're going to need to do is verify your account so you are going to go into your email so you are going into your inbox and then you are going to verify it by tapping on the email that they have sent you once you have verified your email address all you'll need to do is simply scroll down then you are going to see the option your connect marketplaces and you'll simply tap on that and you're going to fill in the basic business information so for example if i were to tap on it you are going to tap on complete verification and then they are going to ask you some basic questions and once you have answered the basic questions you'll be able to connect the marketplace so you'll be able to connect it to your shopify store i don't know why it keeps on refreshing so let me tap on activate your account so it will basically lead you to this page right here then you'll tap on get started and you're going to need to provide them with your government id and some basic information and that's it as you can see right here and i hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative normally some persons would go onto shopify so let me go back so another option that some persons normally use once they're on Shopify, they would tap on settings also. And after tapping on settings, they would go over to the left hand menu option once more, tap on payments. And from there, they would normally see the wallet option. But I think this depends on the country that you're in as I no longer see the wallet option. And for example, if you were to tap on add payment methods, and you were to type in Apple Pay, you would still not see it right here. So if I were to type in Apple, you won't see Apple Pay pop up as you can see right there. And you can search by, by provider and you also won't see Apple Pay. You will see different payment methods as you can see right there. So I hope this tutorial was able to help you. If it did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.